Hello everyone, Carrot here with major changes. After finishing the machine production setup in the last episode, I encountered a bunch of problems on system-wide level. I believe I have found the solutions of many of them and I'm excited to share all of it with you right after you smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. This video takes me a good amount of time and I really appreciate your support. Alright, now where to begin well i think you can already see some of the things and i can't wait to show you those but first i want to show you something else and this is this little setup here that i created for the food plant in oklahoma because we need more food and please be patient i will share with you everything else i just want to start this setup going so that we can see the results during this video so we have a train station here for this farm a train station here for this farm a train station here for this farm and another one here so my initial plan was to create like a circular line which comes with one train and picks up everything but i don't think that works very well because of the mechanic of the game to pay you uh for a straight line from um origin to destination which means for this farm it's going to be from here to there and not all the way on the circle so instead I'm going to create three lines, four lines, one delivering the grain from here to here, a double one from here to here, a triple one from here to here, and a quadruple, quadruple one from here to the Oklahoma cargo station. All right, speaking of that, let's start doing this. So we have a line from here to here. We only want loading and here we want unloading. We will call this cargo rail supply. And that's going to be Okla Farm 1. And this is Grain Supply. Awesome. Let's put this one over here. And continue. This will be like that. Here again in the first one we have load. And unload. This will be... Again, CRS, Okla, Farm 2, Grain, Supply. We will take it over here. And continue. New line from here to here. This will be CRS, Okla, Farm 3, Grain, Supply. Put it here and I don't know why I close it every time just a habit I guess this will be CRS Okla farm 4 grain supply okay uh, actually this could be just <coughs> sorry uh, Okla grain supply yeah why not and we put it over here did i make this one this will be first is load and then it's unload yep and here we have the same first is load and then it's unload and we also have four and here yeah i don't think i have a choice this one is not connected okay that's it so now i have to start adding trains from this depot first to these two and then to these two so i think let's see locomotives we will put power or speed let's, let's do speed because i don't i will add here there are very short lines i will add the 80 kilometers per hour locomotives i still have them until 2000 which is nice um which means I don't need anything fast. So we have these two at 80. And I think we definitely are going to choose this one. The two of these guys kind of add up to one of these. We have... Yeah, but that attractive effort is definitely not increasing. I think it stays the same even if you add more locomotives. I have no idea. Really. I think this one should be the choice. 
So let's start with this and then we add. We are going to transport grain and this small one. And I'm going to add this and add it to the farm one. Can we zoom in a little bit? Okay, that's going to be farm one. Actually, let's buy four. Yes. And then we're going to. Okay. I did not mean to do this. Let's add the first one to farm one. Then we're going to add second one to Okla Grain Supply. And then this one is going to go to. Actually, let's maybe. Ah, oh, the game is playing. So these boys are already going. Okay, cool, cool. And now we're going to add this one to farm 2 and this one to farm 3. Okay, now this boy has a rate of 0. Okay, that's very interesting. Rate of zero still. Oh, because I did. <laughs> okay, that was very dumb. Uh, sorry about that. Forgot to add my wagons everywhere. Actually, that's not such a big deal. So we have... Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, so manage. So 50. We need... We're looking at 200. So that's just four. Okay. 200. Perfect. So let's click on this boy as well and we can change its color to the green color. Amazing. Okay, I think this line is ready. Let's see, green 2. This one should have 400. So let's add one. 46. So we need 8 wagons, 9. 6, 8, 9. 417 is perfect. So this one is going to be as well. Okay. And then we have farm 3. So it has to be at 600. Forty-seven. They're very similar because the distances are similar. So this means uh, five, fifteen, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, seven hundred and five. Okay, calculations were wrong. Six fifty-eight. I think I can sell one more. 600 okay awesome just let's not forget to give it the color perfect and last but not least oh we have to change this one before they can start producing so manage five oh 35 only okay i hope one train makes it I would really, really, really hope so. 887. Okay. So we can remove two, I think. 816. Perfection. Okay. Now we should start seeing this going up. Exactly. It's split it in four, which I guess makes sense. Kind of, yeah. Because now our level here is 100. Another bad thing about Oklahoma is, look at that, all of our food is over here, so I should create a line to drop it. It's very weird how the plants cannot just supply their surroundings, but okay. I guess the developers, because of how the uh, industries are generated in the free game, they didn't think that's ever going to be a need, but it kind of is. Let's see, we need to build a building, cargo building. 
Yeah, this sounds cool enough for me. Let's do one on the right. 20 meters is fine. Put it like this. Okay. And we need to create a line from here to here. It's going to be cargo truck. Mokla. Foot. Drop. And very interesting what's happening. Rain 63. No path. Oh. Well. <laughs> I guess that's a mistake that, of course, we can make. <laughs> uh, let's give it very quickly the path can go buddy go 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 oh my god you are very slow <laughs> don't tell me that what's going on here now It went first to the other side. Oh. One has to go to three. Okay, so you go to the depot. Dumb. Dumb, dumb. Didn't see. Well, it's kind of obvious, but... Why is it stopped? What happened? I'm like, did the game freeze? Ah, auto save. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. Actually, let's speed things a little bit. Go, 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 go. I need to do the foot drop. Uh, in the meantime, let's keep this boy here. Uh, let's let's buy trams. Let's buy one and assign it to the... Oh, not possible to assign it there. Everything good now? Yes. Okay. Wait. Can we go? Yes, we can go. Assign to three, right? Now you will go. Awesome. Thank you very much. Okay, and we can assign this to the... Yes, foot drop. 190 is plenty. This should cover everything that we might need. And we have consumers here. Did I see production without grain? <laughs> very cute. Consumers. Interesting. Suppliers, sure, but consumers? Why is not consuming Oklahoma not... Nothing. This is the correct type, right? Sure is. Foot. Yeah. Ooh, let's actually give it the collar. And here it's going to be... Load. Load. Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. Again, we have some... Ah, we already have grain. Nice. I like. It's very interesting. Can I put signals here without causing trouble? Yeah, I think so. Pretty good. It's... Uh... I don't know who is coming here at this moment. Few deliveries, okay. But still, it's better to have it like that. Ooh, and this we don't need, I think. Any more? Okay, I think this setup is looking very nice. Yeah, they are... Ooh. Okay. Ah, yeah, because we need... 
What do we need? We need 200, yeah, for 100. Yeah. So these guys are adding up to 200 at the moment. Well, this is going to lose some money for the time being, but not that much. Exits, the station enters. Nice. Alright, so. Now, let's see what else there is to review, and that is actually plenty. Uh, so, let's start through here. As you can see, for a very long time, actually, you probably can't, but. Okay, here. Okay, look at that. Look at that. I had some terrible, terrible years. And a huge profitability crisis, like an enormous one. And what was the deal with it? Um, the deal was that two things, two main things that were causing the, ma the majority of issues in the game. The first one was the setting that I did for um, before I created the map and the whole game. In the menus before creating the game, you can increase the percentage of bonus that having destinations in the city gives you. So basically, instead of being plus 160, it would be plus 320. So I increased it from 100% the normal to the 200% if you remember. If you don't, I will show you next time I create a game. Anyhow, I removed that one back to 100. And which one else? That's it, right? The destinations. But I kept the cargo because the cargo is something that I think it's not a bad idea. Also, it doesn't give such great bonuses. So, and we do a lot of work to bring the cargo. So I think it's worth it to still keep it there. Okay, that led to... Not trucks, uh, towns. That led to this huge, huge, huge drop. As you can see, I also lost almost 50% of uh, everything. And this is the cargo deliveries bringing it back up with what is this like 20 percent maybe yeah with more cargo that i bring to the cities there will be more people again and more destinations and so on and so on it's like a domino so yeah this is the first big change that i did change the setting for the game for the percentage of bonus that these connections give us sorry these ones all right the other change that I did, and that was the other major issue, is that the game is definitely not made to have the double capacity mod that I added. So I removed it from the game and I recreated all the industries so that they go back to their natural level. Because when you double this, it becomes impossible to supply everything without having enormous traffic jams and too many vehicles, too many trains, too many of everything. So yeah, the other problem was that I had so many trains having to deliver things for example to Boston where we have two productions sorry three productions now currently two ongoing it was just crazy crazy amount of trains and it was not sustainable so yeah that's the other major change that I did removing the double capacity mod why I don't have enough grain here is beyond me anyhow yep that two major changes and as you can see we are back on track with everything that's a lot of good sustainable profit here i think this is a lot of investment that i did and it's looking fine um we are not going to get rich very quickly but for now we are doing good towns are going back up and yeah okay uh the two major ones are those but then there is a lot of small ones for example the one of the big ones of course made all the cities smaller as you can <laughs> notice probably like new york was much bigger in the surroundings boston as well so i had to figure all of this out delete what's uh, unnecessary streets and things like that that took me a while certainly and i have done a few changes to public transportation as well which i'm going to show but before that you have probably already seen that i have different designs for my stations and i think that's going to be the final change i think i learned a lot in this playthrough um and one of the 
core issues that was happening is that because of these long pathways that I created for fast entrance to the station, when we have to leave and then cross them in the same place, a lot of waiting is happening and I didn't like that. So you will notice that all my stations now have, um, how to call this, turnaround um, underground tunnel pathway which uh, usually connects back to the site that is necessary for the trains to go and that oh my god that helped so much like i have literally zero waiting anymore only in some of the uh, i don't know junctions like this one sometimes for a very limited amount of time you can see something like that but i am doing improvements constantly if i see that too many lines are passing through a certain point where uh, you can have conflicts of um, different trains. So yeah, let's start reviewing uh, the cities one by one. So as you can see, Boston here has its turnaround pathway for the rail to go back. And uh, believe me, that's very necessary because I have to bring a lot of things here. And actually bring back some as well and the goods in the future as well. So that's totally necessary. It's very easy how uh, I, I'm doing it. I will show in the future when I redo some of the stations that I have to still connect. Anyway, uh, other than that, we I decided to do something different with the public transportation. You will see, for example, that... Um, I mean, it kind of similar, but not really. So I have the um, residential lines going from a residential district, but then stopping somewhere in the middle, if possible, if it's not so, uh, a big... Um, change of the straight line that possibly could be taken and you will see here for example from the residential to the commercial to the central back to the commercial and then to the residential again so we have two-way traffic which i think works uh, very well because these lines are kind of break even and they are at 50 percent uh, running costs so i find this to be working pretty well for me uh, this one might be... Ah, that one is also very good. So, yeah. This one is working really, really well. I haven't checked all of them in all the cities. Um, some of them might not be as good because some cities are smaller and they cannot support such a um, high cost lines. But with time, I think I will figure this out. Any The big scale of things, they don't matter that much. As long as the big uh, lines produce what we need in the meantime, let's check how things are going here. Ooh, Oklahoma consumes 110. Okay, that's pretty good. Now I have another question I really don't understand. Since I have coverage to all the food here, why I don't get here a consumer of 150 and 60 now? I just don't get it, really. It's beyond me at this point. But yeah. One is going good we should uh, keep it over here so that uh, i have to do the necessary adjustments and the adjustment is obviously when we have a lot of grain have we upgraded this shipment 80 50 okay 130 fine this one might be profitable already not really okay <laughs> i spoke too soon uh, but yeah, I will have to start delivering some food. Interesting. Delivering it where? To SEDC? To NEDC? It's a good question. So currently I have things on the right. So it should be coming from there. But they can both come from there, to be honest. I think I have more things in the south currently. So it's probably going to be the SEDC. Do I do it now? I mean, it's currently producing as much as it's consuming. And I'm not storing that much more of grain. So slow the poor train. I might add a better locomotive in the future, but for now this is good enough. Okay. Let's proceed. If this gets uh, to get too high and we're not producing enough, that means that we can add more consumers. 
I really hope that this raises. I don't know why, seriously, why this is not going higher. Anyhow, uh, New York. Uh, New York follows a similar pattern, but we have this station, which is, where is it? In the industry department. So this should be New York industry one. Okay, and here we have New York commercial one with this line which is making money which is very nice and we have rs2 it's very interesting i can actually think about adding yeah let's do it why not let's do rs2 so first from here go to yeah but i should probably add it yeah, I think this will make more sense. So we're going to delete it from here. And at this station here. Should have pretty much the same reach. So from Restu, come here and then to Central Bus. And then... Ah, but I do have this one. Okay, it doesn't matter. I think this is going to work uh, even better. I will delete that one. Uh, I don't know why I had it. I decided to add it there, I guess. I don't know. So, come and then from here, back there. And how does it look? It looks amazing. Right? Although, here, maybe we can change the terminal to be the other one. And that looks even better. Awesome. Why? I... Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay. Now, we should also... Delete this station, we don't need it anymore. And I will figure out what to do with this line in the future or just manage vehicles, sell and delete. Good. Okay, let's see how this is going to go. And another auto save. Makes sense. Okay, and New York, as you can see, has the turn around path also on this side. It's amazing. It's beautiful. I love it. And there is also, because of this, there is no more uh, X junctions before the stations in any of the places. You know, actually, there is another thing I wanted to change here, and that is to... To make the entrance to the station before I join these guys here. Because sometimes they wait everyone who wants to join this station here. And I'm not sure that that's okay. Let's see. Um, problem is, they all start kind of from around here am i going to be able to do it properly okay maybe i will do it but uh outside of the recording but basically my idea is that these guys that come from there and that's everyone coming from the distribution center sometimes wait for let's say passenger trains or other trains that want to go to this station and i don't think that's a good idea because they just stop without any need and there is plenty of traffic passing through here, as you can see, there is many lines. So, yep. Okay, that's New York. Let's see Washington. That's the station. It's very typical. Nothing uh, like extraordinary, but it's super cool. It works flawlessly. Here we have only one residential for now, which actually doesn't stop anywhere because I guess Washington is still too small. Yeah, these two stations have pretty much access to everything. In the future, if it grows, I can add more. Like two residentials with two stations. One for commercial, one for industrial. Let's see. Charlotte. Charlotte has also only one residential that stops in the commercial area. Potentially, it's going to have as well two, two residentials. One here, one here. Okay. That's looking good. Savannah as well has this new train station design. And here, here we might be primed for changes in the future as well, but it really needs to start going. It has to start produ 
have to start producing more cargo uh, things and deliver them for their needs. Ah, here is super cool. Look at this cute bridge going above the new station design. I find it super nice. Look at this. Amazing. Okay. Uh, here I think I have two. Yep. One going to the industry and one going to the commercial area. It's very nice. E, not that much. Actually, while we are here, why don't we buy a passenger? Okay, let's buy this one and assign it to rest too. And manage vehicles, sell this one. There we go. How about the other one? Ooh, losing me money, I see. I think because we don't need two vehicles. Okay, let's sell the one with 10, like this, and that's a good optimization. Okay, Miami. Miami is a little bit different. I didn't have space, I guess. I mean, I could probably make it a circle, but that means I have to destroy a few things here, and I don't like that. And the solution is uh, different. We have double flip switches here. And one connection going there. There is not that much traffic coming here, so I don't think it matters much for Miami. So I think that's good enough. Most of the things, if not all, are going to be coming by ship. And that's it for these guys. Let's go Havana. I think... Have, I, have you seen this? I don't know, but there is also some new designs of the ports. I don't know if I uh, show that already. A residential one as well, only one here, passing to the commercial. The industry is too small for us to add lines there. Interesting enough. Yeah. Hmm. Let's hope it grows. Here. Ooh. 27. Yeah, that's that's good. That's good. Only one line, right? Ah, uh, but also we have a commercial one. Which is not doing that bad. Okay. TNC has one line going to the airport from one end to the other of the city. Uh, it's uh, doing fine, I guess we can keep it. And Bermuda, as you can see, has shrinked. <laughs> and we have the same. Uh, but here. Because of how the line went, I decided to add it a uh, middle middle station. Oi. Finances are fine. I think I might decide to manage vehicles and copy this one and sell this boy. Yep, that seems better. Cool. Uh, that's it for these guys. Oh. Let's check on our food production here. Consumer 126. Good, good. It's going up, right? We we are storing a little bit more. Maybe it's time. Okay, let's create a line from here to the SEDC. This is going to be cargo rail supply. Okla, ACDC, and that's food supply. We are going to have the food color, and we are going to have four now. Load here, unload there, because I don't think I have anything to deliver for now. I don't have goods, machines, nothing. Uh, a few things before we continue. 4 is probably not where I want you to be because the grain goes there. I can go to 1, two, 3 and 4. How does it look? It looks fine. Terminals. Okay, so uh, supply 1, starting from Okla, is going to need the, the um, terminal. But a delivery one like this one doesn't, so it doesn't matter. So these ones are fine. Okay. That looks good. Now the only question is in the south. East distribution center. It decided to go there. And that does not make sense, does it? 
Why not the other way? Why not from here and then go this way? Hmm. Interesting question. I don't think... Let me see. You know what we are going to do? We are going to add a train first and then we will see which one is faster. Uh, a train from... Not here. Train from here. Yeah, I don't think so, though, right? Can this body connect there? No. Okay, so it doesn't really matter. Could be from here. Fine. Ah, also, in any case, this line is long. Whatever it passes from. So I think we can add 120 kilometers per hour wagons right which means locomotives which means 130 140 160 big boys too expensive it is going to be too too expensive it's going to be uh, the muf and wagons cargo this is food we're going to be delivering food at buy and assign to what is it okla cdc food supply 17 minutes 13 oh okay what if we add 8 12 18 minutes so this one is slower hmm okay so it's going to be the other one then Thirteen, seventeen 17 minutes okay so that means seven six five four three two one if you find it faster you find it faster okay uh let's start with one train i guess let's add them 130 that's 10 start with one train See how it goes. 240, yeah, and 160 for Oklahoma itself, it's 400. Okay, the only problem that we have now is we want to have the color. The food color. Okay, awesome. That's it. It's going to go to uh, SCDC first, but I don't think that matters for me. It's going to lose me money nevertheless until the... Everyone understands that we have more consumers. Atlanta, I think, needs food. There is plenty of needs for food. You see, Savannah, Panama, everyone is going. Okay, I think it's time for Pittsburgh. Yeah, uh, oh, okay, oh, we also have this one with um, turnarounds see how we go here it's 100 okay everything is going fine 439 looks good looks good cool now Pittsburgh how it's Pittsburgh uh, residential one with an industry stop and residential two with commercial stop Yep. Atlanta. Ah, Atlanta was a little bit different. Yes, 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 yes. Because of this plant here, I couldn't do the circle. So I made a different circle. <laughs> Going first this way, 45 degrees, and then making a tunnel. And... Ah, and coming out here. <laughs> Yeah, I got confused for a moment. So yeah, these trains coming from there. And let's say who is going there. Let's see. Passenger lines mostly, I think, at this moment. Yeah, yeah. Are going back through this way, entering the main line from here. Not the best, but it is what it is. 
uh, here we have uh, also a connection directly to instead of going to the main line for I think I have at least two three now three different lines that connect directly to this connection to the other main line so yeah we have another train line here going this way okay um atlanta is with two residentials one passing through here and another one passing through there that's my investment here okay that's for atlanta panama panama has one residential two residential probably not doing very well yeah i was sure because panama is kind of small you know yeah both of these are going to be replaced we will buy two one goes to panama one yeah that's what happens this one goes to panama two and then this one is sold and this one is sold as well that's it cool nothing changed here oh wow we have traffic jumps look at that bermuda fuel delivery there is not enough oh my god what's happening why i have so many ships for bermuda waiting here for fuel where is the fuel for bermuda we have a ton for miami wow bermuda bermuda super interesting things i have to investigate what's happening okay uh new orleans again new station design and two residentials not doing very well at least this one the other ones might be good okay uh buy this was res one sell this boy okay and rest two is fine okay houston ah houston has the circle line doing not that good uh i can keep it it's not losing that much money this one as well or i can just add a smaller vehicle of course buy ah the out safe as usual by the way uh scaling down the game absolutely helped with uh the game performance as well circle clock counter clock let's sell okay maybe not this one this one this one quickly okay eight is small enough goodbye and that's it now they should be better and this is austin res one yeah you could see that like when you see a smaller city it's probably not good with uh and this one is probably not neither actually not doing that bad but still things have to be profitable man it we don't have money to spend on bullshit When you grow, we will give you a tram. And the last one is our friend Oklahoma. Okay, this is interesting. Ah, 143. This one went down for reasons. Uh, one of the reasons might be that we didn't give it alternative terminals, maybe. Yeah, 190. Should do just fine. Maybe that's one of the reasons why we didn't have uh, enough consuming in Oklahoma. We'll see, we'll see. Okay. 
This boy, how is it doing? 721. Well, I don't see a problem here yet. These guys have to be upgraded. When this gets upgraded. And it is, because we are getting consumers. I should increase the food delivery lines there, probably. We'll see, we'll see. Oh my god. 487. This should be 600. I don't understand why it's constantly doing this to me. Are these trains like not fast enough or something? Should be 600 because... Ah, yes, that's the other thing I changed. I completely forgot. So, uh, Kansas does not deliver to Boston directly. It delivers to NEDC. Same goes for Detroit, delivers to NEDC. And Pittsburgh as well delivers to NEDC. Why? Because that's proper. And then we have only one line that delivers everything to Boston. This one. And it should deliver 600 because we have 200 here. Hmm. Also, this one does not do a good job. 357. It's almost like there has been a traffic jam. Could be here. This is a big problem, I think. All of these guys come from around here. So I am super curious if I will be able to do something about this. Eesh. Tracks. No, no, no. What if, okay, let's keep them here like this. What if I, no, but it's the game is not going to allow me to start making rails from here, which is very unfortunate. By the way, how is our airlines doing? Uh, not great, not terrible. I don't like to see empty things. That's good. We are not having overloads here. Alright, so still here is fine as well. I think I have struck the balance. Not this one, but this one. This one is eh, but it's still fine. Bermuda T and C. Maybe we need only one. Yeah, goodbye, you. New York Rest 2 might need another. Oh, wow. Interesting. So they're full. There's people waiting, but I'm still not making money. Okay. Sure. If you say so. Let's check if we have some mediocre Boston. Hmm. Very interesting. Boston Res 1 and Boston Res. No, but Boston Res 1 has more. This is Res 2. Res 1. I don't think... Uh, a whole tram, maybe we can add one to each. Boston Res 1, Boston Res 2, and see how it goes. Okay, the passenger lines I think are doing fine. As long as there is a few people waiting, this is good. If there is no people waiting, we might have to bigger for capacity. Char Savannah. Yep, for example, this one is probably wasting money. There we go. Here is fine. Miami Tampa has some on this side, but that's okay. Yeah, I don't see any problems here. Ooh, Atlanta, Nashville. Look at that. Yeah, but not on this side. And here we have New York, Nashville. And I don't think on the other side it's the same, so... Nope. 
I guess it's just everyone that came to Nashville now wants to go back to New York. Happens. Sorry. Ooh, Panama, New Orleans. No, 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 no. Tampa, Panama is empty. No. This is the minimum. Okay. And this one, Houston, Nash. No, it's doing good. And oh. oh. No, no. What am I doing? Okay, doing good as well. Atlanta, Okla, I don't think. Mm. Potentially, if it grows. For now, it's good. Okay, are we still making money? I think we are. It's pretty good. Now, what's going on here? Consumers. Oklahoma went down. Why not? Don't understand this game sometimes. So, I have coverage. But it doesn't want to deliver. I don't know, maybe if I add trucks. Uh, but I have done that and it does not change anything. Does that mean more stations? Doesn't make sense. Is this going to get upgraded to level 3? Come on, you can do it. But we need more consumers, I guess. What do we have here? 166 delivery for Savannah, that's fine. Uh, Panama. Uh, Panama has the food delivery here. 154, that's probably enough. Yep. In Atlanta, food delivery 56. Uh, I also changed a bunch of trains to use cheaper, cheaper uh, lo lo locomotives. Not this one. Ah, oh, that's food, yeah. It should be fine. 160, 167. Yep, very good. Eh, maybe one less. Awesome. Cool. Now, this should be enough consumers. I'm pretty sure because Atlanta, Savannah, New Orleans, let's see. Uh, yeah, Charlotte is giving 40, but sure. Here is 14481, Charlotte, Oklahoma, 28. Okay, maybe I can add more, but I don't think so. How is this one doing? 400. Miami and Tampa. Okay, actually, I should start probably bringing some more food here. I don't know. Because this one wants 267 and this one 201. We are above 400. For now, I guess it's good. Should connect more food production. I have one here, one in Kansas, but we have to connect Kansas eventually. And then then starts to become more difficult with the food. But that's probably for another day. Poor. Commercial one. Honestly. I might have a direct commercial link. As before. Should not have deleted it. Via the central. Yeah, because they probably want to go. Shop in the commercial ones. New York, Res 1. This is Res 1, right? No, this is Res 2. Interesting. Oh! We have a lot of people here on the Res 1 and a lot of people here. Let's see how we're going to do with two of them. Here we already had two, right? Yeah. I will see if this continues. Maybe we will add a separate line or something else. We'll see. Yeah, 357 because... Look at that. 155, 152. When I have 248 and 237. And I have coverage. 
unbelievable sometimes. Look at that. Complete coverage of everything. Complete food coverage, complete industry coverage. No idea. And it doesn't want to supply me with more. Not only that, it goes down because of transport problems. I don't understand how the game chooses these things sometimes, but it's dumb. Yeah. I'm not going to add more capacity here, forget it. I literally have, let's say, 250 and 240. Five, 490. So 310 is plenty, and this one has 357. Nope. That's it from me. Something else? Boston, New York, rest two. Which one is that? That's in New York, right? Yeah. Three. New York, rest two. We just added the second tram, so this should get better. Other than that... I don't see terrible things. Oklahoma... Okay. Why 76? That's very weird. 162. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's how much you produce. This is growing, I guess? Man, I don't understand some of these things sometimes. Should be growing faster. Well, where is our boy? Hmm. Okla SCDC food supply. This one is probably absolutely losing money. <laughs> yeah. Ah, it already picked up some food. Nice. 98, 99. Slowly going to 120. Yep. Well, I hope you liked today's episode. I would love to read your thoughts on the last changes in the comment section. Don't forget to support my work by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. And as always, thank you for watching.